Water pollution is one of the major threats to global health. Water pollution is a global problem and most of it is the result of industrial waste. Factories dump wastewater into canals and rivers and lakes, increasing water pollution. Not only industrial waste, but human waste. Misuse of water resources, acid rain from fossil fuel fires, spillage of petrochemicals is also a major cause of water pollution. As a result of these causes and events, about 9 million tons of pollutants are dumped into the ocean each year, with plastics being the most abundant of these wastes. Plastic pollution is accelerating and has a significant impact on not only humans, but 15% of the world's seabirds consuming are also suffering from gastrointestinal disorders due to plastic consumption. In addition, waterborne E. coli kills more than 3 million people worldwide each year and causes serious illnesses related to stomach issues can be caused due to water pollution to even more serious illnesses such as typhoid, cholera, and paratyphoid, dysentery, and amoebiasis. According to research records, polluted water contains chemicals, pesticides, lead, and nitrates, arsenic, fluoride, and can also contain oil-related substances which can damage the liver, your lungs, brain and nerves, and even cause reproductive health problems and cancer. It is absolutely not ideal to allow such water pollution to continue to pollute our environments. In hindsight, water pollution is a global problem that poses a threat to humans and other species. Therefore, national action is needed to combat water pollution as quickly and effectively as possible. We will also see a positive effect that can be achieved if every individual stays aware and avoids to cause water pollution. It is the universal truth that all living things can have a healthier world if everybody stayed vigilant and were careful not to pollute our environment. Therefore, in today's episode for World Pollution on our Love for Nature program, we will talk about how to prevent water pollution. Number 1. Do not throw any garbage into ponds or drains. Number 2. Do not clean any public pools or rivers with items that may contain chemicals. Number three, do not dispose of wastewater containing pesticides and other chemicals from your farmland into rivers and streams. Number four, do not drink water from rivers near factories or workshops. And number five, do not drink colored water. These are the behaviors that the audience should avoid. And here are some tips to help you prevent water pollution. The first and foremost thing to do is to dispose of your garbage properly. Whenever possible, you should dispose the garbage after separating it into different types of garbage. Garbage can be separated into electrical and energy products, glass and ceramics, papers, kitchen utensils, chemicals, and therefore should be disposed of separately and disposed of in a designated manner. In addition, there is a lot of unhealthy waste in our environment. Anyone who is involved in wastewater should report it to the relevant authorities. On the other hand, you should share as much knowledge about water pollution as you can in your area. By doing so, we will start reducing water pollution, waste will be reduced, and the earth and all living things will be able to live in safety and good health. Thank you for watching today's episode to the end. Don't forget to stay tuned for more general knowledge about our environment, and I'll be seeing you guys in the next video.